On July 15, 1944, a 71,000-strong United States Expeditionary Force invaded the island of Saipan in the Marianas. After a bitter battle, the Americans won. Victory came at a great cost. Some 3,000 died in battle, and another 10,000 were wounded. Some Japanese soldiers, like Captain Sakae Oba, held out in the jungle long after Saipan fell. Japanese intelligence outposts continued to operate on the smaller Marianas Islands, monitoring the training flights of B-29 bombers from Tinian. One of these outposts on the island of Agrihan was commanded by Colonel Saito. Colonel Saito's final moments were captured on film by his aide, Lieutenant Kobayashi, who also died in the attack. Okay, wow, I doubt. The president of Nakagawa Corporation, Mr. Shigeru Saito, announced today a great victory on the business battlefield. His company, Japan's leading robot maker, won a huge contract to sell robots to China. These robots will replace hundreds of thousands of Chinese needle trade workers, making that country even more competitive. The deal will help the Japanese company sustain its breakneck expansion. moved his facilities to Agrahan Island. To train his robots for work on Mars, Agrahan will be run entirely by robots. Many people now refer to Agrahan as Bot Colony. Every day, everywhere, on board or off, Nakagawa robots work to improve our lives and increase our efficiency. They make our deep sea journey safer and take our deep space journey further. In every aspect of life, Nakagawa and its robots are faithfully committed to the benefit of all mankind. People like you and I no longer have to risk our lives in dangerous situations or doing dangerous jobs. From the surface of our home planet to the farthest reaches, Nakagawa robots labor to mine the minerals we need and build the foundations of our society. In hotels and bars, they are the sustainable, reliable, and independent workforce the hospitality industry needs. They are entrusted to watch over and entertain our children while we are busy at work or with our day-to-day -day lives. As well, they can be completely dedicated and truly understanding companions to our beloved elders, caring devotedly, listening patiently, day in and day out. Nakagawa, robots for a better life. It's longer than I thought. in Japan. We are contacting you because we're interested in the same cognition. We have a strange situation at our facility on Agrihan. Three specially designed advanced sensors have recently disappeared. Agrihan, as you may know, is run almost entirely by robots. We need someone who has a highly developed understanding of robotics to investigate and help us recover these sensors. There is one thing of importance that you should know. Our Korean competitor has been sniffing around and they would love to get their hands on these prototypes. It is of the utmost importance that you prevent this at all costs. If you accept this mission, please affirm the contract. Ticket to Tokyo and the Marianas are waiting for you. Good luck. Okay, that was a lot longer than I expected it to be. Anyways, this reminded me a lot of uh, the movie I Robot. Whoa, hi. Calm down there. But yeah, the movie I Robot with Will Smith, it, remind, it reminds me so much of that because it's pretty much exactly like what, you know, what those robots were doing, you know, just kind of taking over the, you know, everybody 
more or less. Just kind of taking over all jobs and stuff like that and... And woo! But anyways, Bot Colony is the first video game built on intelligent AI-powered conversation. You speak with robots or types to investigate mystery or to command them to do things. Robot actions and answers depend 100% on your commands, questions, or location taking interactive interactivity and immersion to a new level. This game is in early access, so... So yeah. Alright, let's just go right in. I'm so excited to find out what this is all about. Oh, I can change the name. Oh, oh, oh. Um, Mick Dugo. Hmm. Poopy. Poop, 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 poop. <laughs> let's go with that. Oh, you're the female. You will be McDougal Poo Poo. I'm excited, like, to do a conversation with like AI, um, like AI intelligence to to do stuff in a game. I'm actually excited. Oh, hello. Where did I go? I begin simulation. All right, here we go. We believe we have a spy among us. To catch him, you won't think like him and operate like him. Your training starts with a video game incorporating real robot software. This game will test your observation skills. Watch our dramatization carefully. Hey doggy. Oh. We are very well hidden, guys. Are we uh splinter cell now? Ah, that would be a very uncomfortable bathroom there. So, find something in the toilet, and then knock the vase down. As you saw, the spy broke into the house of a scientist to steal a secret prototype chip. He hacked your robot in order to remote control it after he left. Before touching anything, he photographed each room and hid cameras in the walls. After he left the house, he remote controlled the robot, put everything back in its place, using the hidden cameras to watch the robot in action and direct it. You will take it from there. Your mission is to look at the spy's photos and detect what objects the spy disturbed. You command the robot put these objects back in the original positions, erasing all traces of the intrusion. Get ready to play our enemy. You only have a little time to erase your traces. Hajime. Uh, what? What would I do? That dramatization didn't help me at all. He knocked down everything. Are you kidding me? If you, if you like pooped in the room, you probably would want me to clean it up as well. Okay, we're waiting. Hi, I'm Miki05, your training guide. Welcome to your virtual training simulation. We have digitally recreated the house you saw in the dramatization. You are now looking through a camera in the house using the tablet, just like the spy did. You can exit the tablet interface and look around the garden at any time. Whoa. He has a left click and drag. Hi. Greetings. Hello? Why am I no mic won't no work? Oh wow. How are you? I'm feeling great. How are you? I am good. That's nice. 
I'll clean up the house. I wasn't programmed with the clean command. Would you like to teach it to me? Yes. To teach me a new command, please use the commands I know, one step at a time. You can ask me about my commands whenever you need help. What? When you are done teaching me, just say end. I know some manipulation commands, some movement commands, and some communication commands. You can return to the tablet interface at any time. Okay. You are now in remote communication with the Nakagawa robot. Next, we will cover conversation through speech or typing. Speak into the microphone or simply type your message. Wait. Review your message in the dialog box for accuracy and then press enter to send it. Hello. Introduce yourself to the robot. Hello. Hello. Okay, yes, that, yes, that, that mic doesn't work. All right, why well, I, I tried that one. My name is Mick Dugo, um, but, um, poo poo. Hello, McDougal Poo Poo. My name is Jimmy. Congratulations, you have just made contact with the Nakagawa robot. Nakagawa robots respond best to direct questions and commands. Each robot's knowledge is limited to what it needs to know to do its job. Ask the robot, what are your commands? I already did! What are your commands? I know some manipulation commands. Some movement commands and some communication commands. For example, my manipulation command a pull, rotate, swap, close, put, drop, pick up, align, push, replace and open. I remember all that. Nakaga robots can learn from humans. Their artificial intelligence will record any fact you teach them. Do you remember that you told the robot your name? Well, the robot remembers. You can see for yourself. Ask the robot what your name is. Your name is McDougal Poo Poo. Thank you. Press F10 to open the dialog history. You can scroll through the previous messages with a thumb pull. Your first mission is to discover as much as you can about what happened in the 48 hours leading up to the break-in. If you ask a question about something Jimmy saw, he may show you a video from his memory. To complete the mission, you need to discover why the prototype chip was in the house and why the family wasn't home when the spy arrived. Show me your... For a perfect score, you need to see all 14 of Jimmy's videos. You should then be able to piece together exactly what happened. Show me your videos. If you have already... Sorry. I've... First, find out who lives in the house. You can ask Jimmy as many questions as you'd like. When you're ready to move on to the next investigation technique, press page down. Okay. Sorry, a video offer can only be unlocked by questions about the events shown in the video. Who entered this room? Here is what I can remember. Hideki entered the living room, rubbing his eyes. Oh, Takashi entered the living room. Show me. I am sorry, McDougal Poo Poo. I don't understand. Show me who entered this room! I think you are talking about education. No! Next, find out about the members of the family. You can ask, who is a Yame? Or, what do you know about Marsaria? Who is a Yame? I'm collecting my memory. Ayame is a woman, and Ayame is the mother of two children, and Ayame is the mother of Takeshi and Hideki. Ayame is the wife of Masaya. Who 
is Miyase. Did you mean who is Mirage? Okay, next one. You can also try. When did you last see Marsalia? Oh. When did you last see Masaya? I saw Masaya at 22 hours 32 minutes and 0 seconds on the 27th of August 2021. Okay. You can press the up arrow to see previous messages. Yeah, I know. I learned it myself. Try editing your previous question to ask, when did you first see Marsalia? Did you first? I saw Marsaya at one hours, five minutes, and zero seconds on the 27th of August, 2021. Would you like to see what happened? Say yes. Yes. No, or go ahead with another question. Is that, is that fireplace or is that just a, you know a fireplace full of gold I think that's just a fireplace full of gold as you can see Naka Gauss robots have a timestamp for every event they see practice asking questions about specific times like what happened at 7 30 yesterday You know, this reminds me, instead of like talking to robots and stuff, it's like, it's like her story where you find out like what happened and, uh, and all of that. As if this time you're just talking to a robot. Um. Once you know the time of an event, you can refer to it as then. For example, you can ask, what did Hideki do then? What did you should also try what did the Yame do after that? And what did the Yame do before that? Hideki went to the living room. Hideki entered the living room, rubbing his eyes. Hideki watched television. Hideki went to the kitchen. What Would did you, like you... To see my related visual memory? Say yes. Yes! Or go ahead with another question. Yeah, this is just like her story. Try asking general questions, like, what did Ayame do at 11.30 on the 26th of August 2021? Afterwards, you can practice asking, what happened then? And what happened after that? Did Hideki watch hentai? I don't have an exact answer, but I know that Hideki watched television. Do you know what hentai is? I'm not sure about the answer, but it may be interesting for you to know that I know the Kurinari family. One more, I know myself. Okay. Did Hideki make love with Miya Messiah? I'm not sure I can answer your question. However, I have observed that Hideki pushes truck with both hands. What? I don't understand. Did Hideki, bring any strangers home. I'm not sure about the answer, but it may be interesting for you to know that Hideki left the house. Oh, right, next, next. Now practice asking specific questions. For example, when did Marsalya enter the house? And where did Marsalya go after that? Where did Masaya go after she went to the bathroom? I don't have an exact answer, but I know that Masaya went to the bathroom. Where? What did 
What happened after? Question too vague. Please give specific information about time in your Then history. what happened? I can tell you that I know nothing about that. You can also try asking things like, where was Hideki at 1700 hours on Thursday? Where was Hideki at 0300 on Thursday? Sorry. I can't tell you about what happened before I was born. I did not start to observe things until 11 hours 30 minutes and 0 seconds Thursday the 26th of uh, August Did I actually type the specific day? Oh my gosh, I had to write everything down. That concludes the investigation training. To complete the mission, you need to discover why the prototype chip was in the house and why the family wasn't home when the spy arrived. Remember, you can abort the investigation mission at any time by pressing page up. Good luck. Why wasn't the family home when the spy came into their house? Are you kidding me? That Are you kidding me with that question there? Why wasn't they... What? What kind of question is that? It's like... Why weren't the people at, you know, at the bank at, you know, 3 a.m. when the robbers broke in? Why weren't they? Who knows? Why weren't the security there? What kind of question is that? Show me all your video, all your memories. Sorry. A video offer can only be unlocked. Help me by unlock about the a memory the video. video. Ask me, what should I do now? Help me win. Ask me, what should I do now? Let me win. I am sorry, McDougal Poo Poo. I don't understand. Ah! Robot! No, what I'm... Clean the toilet. No. Move the toilet. Okay. You're in teaching... What? Not what I wanted. Oh my gosh. Okay. I didn't memorize steps for the clean command. I didn't say clean. I said move the toilet. I didn't say clean. I didn't say clean. What the... Move the toilet. No. Uh. Pull the toilet. It isn't movable. Take a shower. It isn't movable. The, what? Anyways, this is Bot Colony, everybody. I have. I'm. I'm. I'm not good at this. I. I. I can't apparently talk to an AI. Just the AI just doesn't understand me at all. But anyways, you guys can check out this game for yourself. The link is down below in the descriptions to the Steam store page. Maybe you guys can do better than me. Maybe you guys can actually activate the microphone. I don't know why it doesn't activate for me, but who knows? I don't know why. But anyways, maybe that would be a lot easier. So if you guys enjoyed this episode of Bot Colony, then please slime that like button and subscribe down below for more awesome videos. Thank you everybody for watching this episode, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye!